What is going on guys, my name is Wyman Tristan, also this is Blitha for Life, and welcome back to Finding Paradise. When we last left off, Colin and Sophia were going on their little honeymoon, and Colin spilled his drink, and... You know, that's a regret we might fix, I, I don't know, I'm still kinda confused on what I'm supposed to fix, but... We're going to... I don't know, I, I think we're going to his team years? Maybe? Can't remember. Let's go! Activate the memento. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. I'd say this is right before his, maybe his teen years, yeah. Hey, your shift's just about to start at the shop. Okay, I'm almost done here. Did you even get your homework done yet? I'll do it when there are no customers. Sneaky, I like it. Did you get yours done? <laughs> Good one. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Uh, he's just allowed to bring his girlfriend to, like, on the plane. I mean, must be a very not strict workplace. Uh, I guess there's really nothing out here. We need five, five things. So, let's go searching. Ah, look at him sweeping. Psst, that new kid they hired is really quiet. Yeah, but at least he gets the work done. Doesn't he have a scheduled flight this afternoon? Yeah, but we're a plane short because someone snagged a blown tire. Unless someone gets cancelled, I don't think he'll get to fly. Doesn't even have an instructor yet. Beats me. Hey, I think they're talking about you. I know, shh. <laughs> Colin, did you know? <laughs> Just screams it out. It's like, yes, Faye. I could pick up on it. Ah, what do we learn in flight school? Hey, it's Faye's drawing. A blurred entry about working at the airport and Faye falling asleep on the wing of the plane. There's also some random class notes. Read? Sure. About runways. Direction... Wait, am I actually gonna need to know this? Oh god, the runway numbers actually tell you the direction of the runway. Simply add a zero to the end of the runway number, and you have the magnetic heading it's facing. Okay. <clears throat> Example, runway 9 means it's 90 degrees on a magnetic compass, so it's facing east. That's also why the numbers on opposite ends of each runway are also 18 apart. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Each plane has a minimum airspeed that m must maintain under each configuration to keep flying. Sometimes about some about exceeding critical of uh, blah 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 blah. Uh, 50 miles per hour. Engine failures. Engine failure doesn't make the plane plummet out of the sky. The plane would no longer be able to climb, but can still land in a pilot control glide. Yeah, because that's what a lot of people think. The second the engine goes down, they just go... Whoo! But no, like, planes will just glide down. Like, we're not just basing our entire life in the engine. We have backup plans. Um, engine failure does not just make the plane plummet... Uh, yeah, 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 we just read that. Uh, close notes. It was like lagging there. That was weird. All right. Every single time. Here, let me get that for you. You just gotta unhook it from the inside and. Cole's a genius! Wow, that's some crazy maneuvering, kid. I've been here for years and I could never figure that thing out. You must have, like, some kind of magical vending power. Um, I only know because I have it so... I have to clean it, so... Oh, Colin. Become friends with that pilot. Man, he does everything here, doesn't he? Okay, here's $24 and change. Wow, that's a lot of pennies. It's okay, I have all day. 
Wow, that's a, a lot of pennies. Yeah. Yeah, no, I know. Can I see what Faye's saying? Hurry up, pennies, kid. Hold up the line. No, and that's not even a thing? Okay. Ugh. All right, what we got? Just like that, huh? And I guess everyone has their reason to start flying. Hmm, and what about you? Well, just between you and me, flight instructing isn't my real passion. In fact, before I came here to teach, I was an acrobatic sky riding pilot. Wow, like making stuff appear in the sky with plane trails? <laughs> yep, I was so darn good too. But then I got fired. Why? I spelled out penis. <laughs> Total discrimination, I tell you. It was all because they found out I'm an illiterate who dropped out of school. Did they care I was the most skillful pilot in the fleet? No. But just because I don't read good, they dropped me like a hot potato. Ugh, it riles me up sometimes just thinking about it. Yeah, that really doesn't sound fair. Well, um, maybe if I need your service one day, I'll be able to hire you. Thanks, kid. Man, first you get my soda, then you vow to give me my laugh meaning again. I see that I'm gonna have a flat instruct the heck out of you. That one will. <laughs> Faze is sleeping. Cute. Hmm, we might be in a bit of a rut. There's still a memory link missing, and the readings indicate we've activated everything in the area. Hmm. Maybe we could stimulate his memory somehow. Stimulate. <laughs> Just start rubbing the ground like that's stimulating his memory. Are you stimulated at Colin? <laughs> Hopefully, let's keep our eyes open. Uh, um, um. I don't know. Huh? Did you feel that? What? I don't know, some kind of breeze. It's probably just the wind. Get it, because she said breeze, so it probably... I, I can't even go out, okay. Um... I got everything prepared and ready, sir. I've done every weight and balance calculation, pre-flight checkup, and document check. Cool, but the wind's picking up, so your solo cross-country's flight's canceled. Why does this always happen to me? I don't know, kid. I don't know what to tell you. Um, what am I supposed to do? That one tile he keeps sweeping must be super clean! <laughs> yeah, that's true. I think they're talking about you. Yeah. Uh, and that's how we clue from Mischief. Any questions? Um, why does the plane have a cat's head? I don't know. It was on there when I got here, so I just rode over it. <laughs> okay. That's because of Faye. Um, what am I supposed to do? Maybe I do have to go outside. Maybe I just... Maybe I have to click on the door? Maybe? I don't know. Uh, yeah, I knew it. Huh, this wasn't open earlier. Did you do that? Uh, if I did, you would know. I've been literally right behind you. In fact, I don't even know why I'm just following you in a constant manner. <laughs> They're poking fun at the game. Um, what? What the heck is this? I don't know. But it seems like this may be our ticket out of this memory. So what? We needed a way to continue and this place just magically opened itself up? In the most unsettling way, no less. 
I'm not sure what's going on with this place either, but there's only one way to go now. Come on, we gotta jump. Oh, hey, no, I can't even look down. It's the only way to find out, Neil. Okay, I'm jumping. Three, two... Oh. S Quit pushing me off, Ledges Eva! What? I didn't push you. The you didn't! Oh, well, that's convenient. Whoa. Hey, you hanging on all right? What is even going on and why is this happening? Wait, tone your ham down. I think I see them inside. Tone your ham down? What is even going on and why is this happening? You're doing just, you're, oh, you're doing just fine. We're not gonna die. Now, do you have a runway inside? I, I think so. Okay, fly the approach and don't forget the cockpit check. Um, make sure full bridge, uh, primer and land locked. Seven Yankee Romeo clear to the runway 121. Uh, zero Yankee Romeo. We're too high. Get some flaps in there. Speed, lower the nose! Oh, uh, alright, I have control. Oh, thank god. <laughs> Hold on, looks like we're gonna land. Okay. Okay. We're alive. Alright. And... We're... Not dead. Nailed it. Hey, you all good? No, Eva, I am not all good. In fact, I'm dead. Game over! Get the beat up! Alright. That's amazing. Alright. Where is the memento? Oh, that's funny. Is it normal to feel kind of dizzy? Don't worry, you'll get past it in no time. You know what? Here, take my hat. Ah, uh, you remind me back when I was a young lad. As in back then, I also knew someone else who was nervous like you. Hey, you look pretty cool in that. This was nothing compared to the acrobatic skyriding flats I've done, I'll tell you. One day, I'm gonna get back to that. Alright, Memento. You look pretty cool in that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want the hat. There we go. Fire! Bam! Right to the noggin! Also, another headshot. No scope, Eva. Ah, oh, I thought he'd be saying stuff again. Booyah! Give him the concussion! <laughs> You're lucky I programmed my head to be as hard as a rock. You sure play in the head. Prepare the memento! Here we go. I'm gonna prepare it. Um. Uh, n nailed it! Don't tell me why I didn't know what I was doing. Was that? No, I did great. Good, good. And... BOOM! So good at this game. Alrighty. Let's activate the memento. Oh, that's cute. He proposed to her skywriting. Damn it, Barry! Well, he did warn him. <laughs> Will you marry? Regret misspelled proposal. Wait, how did he misspell it? 
Oh. He... He... He missed the second L in Will. I should know that! What's the memento? The cello? Yeah. That's cute! He proposed! Oh. Oh, Barry. I'm always helping him out. Those two guys are like two peas in a pot, I tell ya. Ah, two chums in a... a something. Alright, that took longer than it should have. Uh, okay, now... Let's go, activate. Seriously? Only one single orb for the memory of his proposal? Hey, at least he remembered it. Okay. Where are we now? Maybe young adult? Man, how are you able to pilot an airplane but not drive a car? Priorities, thanks to you. Come on, we're gonna be late. Hmm. She's sure getting lots of screen time compared to his wife at his proposal. There's something about her that really bothers me. Oh, don't take it so personally. It's not like Colin's your husband. That's not what... <sighs> Never mind. Hey, actually... What's the matter? You know, I think I'm gonna pass on this one. It's your first rehearsal with them, right? You're nervous enough as it is. Hey, I'm not nervous! And even if I uh, were... Well, you being there would help. I guess, but... I can't always hang around, you know? Besides, you'll be able to concentrate better without me hanging about. Hey, remember how you always used to tell me your f day after school? Why don't you go on ahead and tell me about after the rehearsal? Okay then, it's decided. Bye! What? You'll be fine. Wow, what a wacky gal. Note, wacky gal. Alright, Colin. It's the moment you've waited for. What is that noise? Okay. This is ominous. Okay. I'm, I'm fine. Hey, the rehearsal is about to start. Chop chop. Couple of blank pages. That's the memento. So Faye is and his wife. Okay, so what? Oh man. Okay, is this the right place? Uh, I can't believe I'm late. Was that Sophia? I guess so. Okay. Okay, stop, stop, stop everything. Something was off around bar 36. From somewhere on my right side. By someone in the cello section. <laughs> I, I really want him to say, stop banging that drum. Someone sitting in the second row toward the front. Colin, is it? I think we're rushing a bit. 
Better watch that. Am I rushing or am I dragging? Or lagging, I can't remember. What's that line? Uh, I will. All right, let's pick up back from bar 35. Right into the solo, ready? Okay. So what happened to Faye? I'm so curious. I think I, like I said in the last episode, I have an idea, but I don't want to say it. Because I don't want it to be true, mainly. Um, yeah, let's keep going. Most of the other ones have been pretty short so far, so. Alright, we need book. Um, oh god. Boom. And boom! Good, there we go. Activate the memento. Now we're getting close to the middle. Oh man, what's gonna happen? Yeah, see, like, we're really close. Is this gonna be the last episode? I don't know, actually. Okay. Uh, alright. I'm done with mine. Me too. Let's see what you... What is that? M my best effort? Going on dates already. He sure moves fast. Well, we're still skipping around. Sometimes probably past. <laughs> A quick pencil sketch. Gee, I wonder who he learned to draw from like that from. Oh, Faye! Yeah, because she drew like the cat. What happened to her, man? I'm so curious. Oh my god. What? Well, I guess I've always loved piano, but... When I was a kid, I had a piano teacher. Every time I played, she made me feel like the worst pianist in the world. For a while, I stopped going, and I stopped playing. But I guess I was a kid with no self-esteem, because it really got to me. And whenever I doubted myself, I'd remember her words. One day, I had enough. And I said to myself, someday, I'm going to be a concert pianist. But isn't that letting her dictate what you do with your life? Well, I guess I have a weird way of seeing things. To me, it doesn't matter which path I take as long as I make the most of it. There's only so little time in this life, and we'd never be able to do it all we want. No matter what we do, there would always be other things to try, other paths to take. That's really true, actually. There's always going to be stuff you want to do. There's a lot of stuff you're going to want to do. But you can really only do one or two things passionately. So in the end, I think I just have to be satisfied with the ones that I took. But I'm just blabbering now. Enough about me. How about you? What made you want to become a pilot? I... oh... yeah. I wanted to fly to places. That's it? You can't say the real reason. A long time ago, a friend of mine, somewhere far away. I guess I just wanted to go find them again. 
Anything important going on up there? Not sure. I was staring at the sharks. Okay, call me when you're ready to move on. Uh, are you feeling alright, Eva? Go take care of this memory, will you? Just leave me be for a while. Okay. No, 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 no. Oh, go back, back down. There's a magnifying glass thing here. A giant walled aquarium. Your hindsight is brilliant as ever, Dr. Watts. Hindsight, you're... You're a genius, that's what I meant to say. Um... Okay. Well... Let's go see what else we got. We need two more. I almost kind of feel like I want to get to the middle. Maybe make this a longer episode because we're so close. Hey, where's it going? Wow, for a cellopod, it sure is cuddly. It actually kind of tickles. <laughs> Ink attack. <laughs> That's a regret you have? I don't think it's that bad. I mean, I don't know. Maybe he wants that to be changed, because he only wants little things changed. He doesn't want big family life things changed. I don't know! Uh, maybe look at Sophie's drawing? Wow, she's good. Yeah, okay. So where's... Where's the... Memento? If I were a memento, where would I be? Don't tell me it's like the fish, is it? Why is this even in the petting pool? No. Okay, where else would it be? Mr. Memento, where are you? It's not any of the drawings. Oh, I bet it's the paper airplane that he was holding. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Man, so like, I mean, I guess we might find out in this next one. But like, what happened to Faye? There it is. One, two, three, four. Prepare memento. I keep looking at the book. Hold on. Okay, good, good, good. Boom! That's all I needed. Woo! So good at this game. Hey, we're gonna go move on now. Go on then. I'll catch right up. All right.
There's either gotta be one more or this is it. You sure are taking your time. Hey, no one's kicking me out. Good thing I got my hours and time, huh? You better have. It's gonna be a different world out there. You ready to go? Yeah, in a moment. You done with your jellyfish phase? It's not a phase, and yes. What's going on here? Not sure yet, but the place looks deserted. Wanna draw a plane? No one will be here to see it anyway. Okay. Uh, I got like a hair in my mouth. Ew. Ugh. Okay. Um, I'm, I know I'm not saying much, but I'm just. I'm so curious. Like, it's locked. Like, I I think we all know what I'm thinking. Like, did she die? Are we supposed to bring her back to life in his memory? I don't. I don't know. You've always liked that picture, yes? Ah! I've had them saved for you. Just a little something to remember this place by. This is a terrible accent. Thanks, boss. You've done good work for us, kid. Honest, respectful work. Oh, and I almost forgot. Your favorite plane's still here for one more day before we move up. If you want to give her one last flight before then, it's on the family. Alright. Then let's go look at it. Wait, that thing's glowing. No severe port closure. Hmm, I guess all things come to an end. Okay. Makes sense. Why everyone's deserted and... Figure that out, kind of. It's locked. Oh, okay, never mind then. <sighs> huh. Okay, nothing over here. Maybe see what facing? <clears throat> These shelves sure look weird being empty, huh? This whole place does. <clears throat> uh, can I go outside? Okay, I can. So what's the next step? With the airport closing down and all? Sure. Well, there's the freight flying job I applied for. I did an interview with them the other day. I think I got a good chance at it. <clears throat> there's still a long way to go, but that'll help me build some more flight hours. Wow. To think that you've actually come so far. It feels like only yesterday we were still standing on that balcony. Thanks for giving me the kick I needed, by the way. Happy to have obliged. Hey, any progress with that lady from the orchestra? Sophia? Well, we've been talking. And? I don't know. I might try to ask her out on a date soon. But, well, you know how I am with that stuff. Want to help me prepare? Oh, I'm not sure if I'd be much help with those sort of things. But if you want advice, I say just work on making yourself more interesting, blah blah. Yeah, yeah, still a work in progress. We haven't been talking as often lately, you know? Sometimes even when I'm here, you just do your own thing. I know. 
Sorry, it's just been so busy. The good kind though, right? Seems to me like you've got it together. I... Hey, you gonna take up that flight the boss offered? Barry said that there's a grass strip near the hill we used to go to, right? Might be a good time to try landing there. Yeah. You coming along? Mm-hmm. Drifted apart. I'm guessing the book is the memento? It's odd how such a simple wish of being happy could be so tangled up. He sure didn't make it easy on us by being ambiguous with the details. Here, I got an idea. Permanent marker! <laughs> there, now let's go get paid! You moron, you can't just draw him a smile like that! Lips are red, not black! <laughs> Great job, now he looks like an affectionate joker. We've almost burned through all the memories, haven't we? I guess the vortex should just jump. Ugh. I guess the vortex should be just up ahead. Good, maybe that'll help us get to the source of whatever what he wants. As if we don't know that already. Hmm? It's her, obviously. There's a reason she keeps on showing up. The guy's clearly got his childhood sweetheart on his mind and he's been asking what ifs. He wants her, but he's got principles, so he knows he can't have her. The perfect equation for a sad, sad man who needs our help hacking the root of the problem. Are you suggesting to remove her? Well, if we do, you'd be the expert. But whatever happens, we'd have to change something. And in the end, she's the one who could alter the most anyhow. Khan himself said we should try to avoid changing things involving his family, right? And out of these memories, Faye's the only other consistency that we keep coming back to. That is true. I guess you're right. We could start with her and work our way up from there. But something still doesn't add up. Hello! <laughs> C could it be? Uh, it oh, it's Roxanne. It's me, Roxy. I'm here. Oh. Has a gun in there. <laughs> uh, awesomely, of course. How uh, <laughs> how are you doing? Did you bring the paperwork? Yep, I brought the paperwork, all right. I also brought Rob. What? I can't stand that guy. I can hear you. Hi, Rob. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Anyway, you guys want to come out real quick and get the paperwork done? We're kind of on a roll here. Maybe we should ask them to help us with the papers. Oh, by the way, Neil, I was gonna ask about the machine. I think I saw- I'm heading out. Get the forms ready for filling. Wait, what? You know the protocols, Eva. Collins are patient now and he- one of us has to check the forms. Yeah, but we've let the others help before, and headquarters never cared. Maybe we should have cared, Eva. Maybe we should have cared. I'm telling you, I don't trust him. When were you one for protocol? Anyway, get that last memory link while I'm gone, will you? It won't take long. And call me when you're ready to go for the next memory. I don't want to miss it. Hey! Act two, you don't have to leave anymore. So let me get this straight. 
You took apart the whole machine because the maintenance department sucks butt. Look, it was the easiest way. Had I just left it to the company process, it would have never gotten done. Much like this paperwork. Oh my gosh, I just realized you're talking about talking and writing at the same time. That's amazing. I hope I didn't cause you to make a mistake. I'm so sorry. You know, sometimes even I can't tell if you're being sarcastic, and that's saying a lot. Come to think of it, you actually remind me a bit of someone from this patient's memory. She's wacky and all over the place, too. Uh, bet I would have loved to meet her. I'm sure you would have. Too bad we're gonna have to do something about her. Anyhow, whoosh, the paperwork's done and signed. Thanks for bringing in the docs, rocks. Ha! <laughs> the docs, rocks. I'm gonna check out on Colin. Oh, you're just gonna get away like that. You might have fooled Eva and Ra, but you didn't... You couldn't... <laughs> Sorry, I had a stroke, but did you think you could fool a fellow technician? I did a quick diagnostic earlier. Seems like you've done more than just removing the stabilizer. The machine you're using here isn't even official Sigmund equipment, is it? Because your re registered machine is back at headquarters in your office. I don't know what you're up to, but I'm gonna find out. Hey Rob, how's the situation looking? It's fine, I was talking with the medical doctor and... What's with the murderous atmosphere? Oh Rob, you tripped him again. No, I am not, in fact, tripping again. It's everything going okay in here? Swimmingly, Neil is just gonna go check on Colin. Yeah, I'm gonna go check on Colin. Okay. Family photos. Huh. Whole lifetime of memories and we barely ran into any of the nice ones. Where's Sophia? Trying to leave him try to leave him be. Disturbances only make my job harder. What said to check on Colin? Fine, let's check on Asher. Huh? Where'd your mother go? I think she went to the attic. Oh. Hey, may I talk to you in private for a moment? Uh, well, sure. Alright, come on. What's up? There's something I wanted to ask you. It's about my father's wish and what you saw in there. You know that's confidential, right? Yes, but... You must know what it's like being on the family of a patient undergoing this procedure. To be honest, my mother was always against it, and I wasn't a big fan either. But if father were to take on a new life's worth of memories, well, knowing what and why would at least help me come to terms with it. So please, could you tell me? Oh, don't give me a choice. No! Don't give me that choice! Oh, dude, I, I don't know, man. He said he does not want his family to know. Colin said, he said, don't let my family know, no matter what. He said, don't change my family life and don't let my family know. God dang it, man. I mean... Yeah. They're gonna be mad, but, like... Colin's the patient. He's the one we're doing this for. And he said two things specifically. Don't mess with the family life, and don't let his family know his wish. So I'm sorry, Asher. Look, as much as I want to spill the beans for you, my hands are tied. Company policies and whatnot. Yeah, I understand. 
Hey, if it helps, he really did ask for you and your mother to stay as part of his whole new life. Okay, we can tell him that. But I can only tell you that much. Hope it still means something. Thanks, Doc. Okay, I feel good about the decision. Alright. Um... I'm gonna leave this episode here, so I guess there's a lot more to it. I wonder how many acts there are. I'm gonna guess three, so maybe we're about halfway done with the game? Maybe. Maybe I need to start making these episodes longer. Well... Either way, I think, so now we're gonna... Are we gonna start with the regrets now? Are we gonna find out what happened to Faye? Because I'm so freaking curious. And there's still one more memory. I don't know, man. Ugh, this game. This game is getting to me. I want to know so badly. But, uh, we'll save that for next time. So, other than that, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, remember to click that thumbs up button. It really helps out, but only if you like this video. Subscribe to join the magic. I remember, guys, keep it clean, keep it magical, and I'll see all of you guys next time. I'm out. Ready, aim, fire.